Hey everybody, welcome back to Building Wars! Last week our challenge was to build a pharaoh. And our winner was... Thanks, you win again! Nice job, bud! Thanks! Everybody love your Sphinx! Thanks, made a Sphinx! Thanks, made a Sphinx! The challenge was not to build a Sphinx! <laughs> they liked it though, good job! Mm -hmm. So far, you guys have had all the fun of doing the voting. But that's gonna change. From now on, we are going to be voting for Comet of the Week. Comet of the Week is our favorite comet for the week. Our comment of the week this week is... Greg Sauter! Congratulations, Greg Sauter! You win a free trip to Hawaii! Sorry, Papa, since your trip to Hawaii has been cancelled, I'll make you a box of fudge all by myself and send it to you in the mail. Speaking of food, we want to thank Kay Riley for sending us a great idea for this week's challenge. That's right, she sent us a video or some links of some pictures of people making art with food. And so this week it's going to be Building Wars and also... Apple! My idea for combining <laughs> apples and balloon art is going to be to make an apple out of the balloons and to make a balloon dog who is eating the apple out of apples. Okay. Hi everybody, for this week's challenge I am going to build an owl out of apples and an egg and a nest out of Legos and I'm going to combine them. For my hour of uh, balloon time, I made an apple and a uh, heat an apple. So, it's done with the Lego hour, and I built an egg and a nest. And that's all. Alright, so how'd it go for you? Pretty good. I could have done better with the Legos, though. <laughs> yeah? Mm -hmm. what, uh, what, what problems did you have? Um, I just couldn't find the pieces I need, and I just c couldn't find the same color either. Okay. So tell us about what, what you made with the apples. With the apples? Yeah. So I made two owls. I made this owl here has raisins for its beak and eyes and little wings here. Ah, cool. I like how the wings move. And then this one... I didn't put wings on because its wings are on its side and it has eyes and its beak is right here where the apple kind of goes out. He's in the nest? Yeah, he cool. just hopped out. Um, yes, here's his nest. Oh, zoom in. Okay. And an egg. Alright, cool. What about you? So how do you do and what do you make? Well, I really like my apple and I got this uh, apple, uh, half eaten apple or eaten apple, just a core left. I think that turned out really good. Mm -hmm. And the worms sticking out. So for my apple part, I tried to make little worms to go with it. Mm -hmm. My original idea of doing a dog was going to be too small, mm -hmm. so I changed the plan. And I've got an apple blossom in front, and a snail, and a butterfly, and a snake. Yeah, so, I see those. Where's the snake at? Snake's over there in front, sticking out his tongue. I don't think my apples oh, look I great, but I think that the, the overall looks pretty good. Yeah. I think I you did better with the apples and you did better with the balloons than I did. We'll have to see what the voters say. Mm -hmm. So please vote. Thanks for watching. Bye.